What are the options for internet access in remote Australia? In most places, there is only satellite. Satellite has many advantages. The biggest advantage is that it is available everywhere. However, there are also several drawbacks. Satellite internet is expensive and it's slow. Heck, the signal has to travel 35,000 kilometres away from your dish and then back again. And then there's the weather. When it's rainy, cloudy or windy, you might not have any signal at all. Unfortunately, satellite internet is not the best solution for applications like online cloud computing, video streaming or any real-time interactivity. But there may be another option in some places. Microwave point-to-point -point wireless. Where this long-distance wireless is possible, it can be cheaper, faster and more reliable. It can also help to take pressure off satellite so it can perform better too. Microwave transmission is used for secure wireless data transmission and it was around long before terms like wireless broadband or Wi-Fi even existed. It works like this. Just as our capital cities are all linked by roads and rail, optical fibre also follows these routes. Fibre provides the best possible service to people in high population areas. You can use this existing high-speed fibre optic cable to service remote locations. You use microwave point-to-point -point wireless to spur off the fibre and transmit potentially hundreds of kilometres to where the telecommunications are needed. Dishes, like satellite dishes, are used to take the signal in hops to its final destination. These long-distance wireless signals are robust and extremely reliable. They can be designed in such a way that interference becomes a non-issue almost no matter what the conditions. Microwave point-to-point -point wireless signals are fast. They are comparable to the speed of fibre. In some circumstances, microwave point-to-point -point wireless can deliver remote internet connectivity that is the same as the services people in cities enjoy. So, the advantages of long-distance wireless are Cost. Long-distance wireless can cost substantially less than the $7,000 government subsidy required to provide satellite to each household. It provides a comparable service for around 10% of the price of fibre. Speed. Long-distance wireless offers speeds comparable to fibre networks. Reliability. Long-distance wireless, when done right, can offer signals that are robust and very reliable. Unlike satellite, there are also no peak or off-peak periods or small download limits. Regional Development Australia Northern Territory and Distant Curve, with the support of many other partners, used microwave point-to-point -point wireless to give the remote NT communities of Batitura and Engawala reliable high-speed internet service. This technology is working today.